Welcome to another KFR trailer reaction. Fun fact, this trailer played at the movie that we just watched. Mm -hmm. And we closed our eyes and plugged our ears. He sang a song I, to himself. I sang an uh, impromptu song. I was <laughs> chewing M&M peanuts, or mm -hmm. peanut M&Ms to drown out the noise. I heard a little bit. I saw a little bit. Mm -hmm. We couldn't fully avoid it. But we did the best we could so we could make this video. We're here for you. We're here for you. And not because of our own egos. Mm -hmm. So uh, before I say anything, I have not watched the second or third Matrix. I've watched the first one. Uh, so going into this one, I have no idea what the fuck's going on. I've seen all three, but I haven't seen two or three since the Sorry. they were in theaters. Go ahead and... Uh, because they don't... Repeat that? Re I have seen all three because... Uh, th but... Some fuck. I have seen... <laughs> I have seen all three, but I have not seen uh, two or three, which I believe is Resur Resurrection. No, no, this is Resurrection. Uh, Reloaded and Revolution? Revelation? Revelation? Re Rev that sounds right, because it's all Bible themed. Mm -hmm. um, I have not seen those two since they were in theaters, because in my mind, they're not that good. But I've seen the first one several times. So, mm -hmm. Matrix Resurrections! Thomas? You seem particularly triggered right now. Can you tell me what happened? I've had dreams that weren't just dreams. Little NPH. Am I crazy? We don't use that word in here. Ooh, no crazies. No. Green Lantern. Is that the Matrix thing come before <laughs> Green Lantern the movie? Is that a ducky, a rubber ducky. Hi. Oh, Trinity. Have we met? One pill makes you larger, and one pill Songs makes a bit on the nose. And the ones that mother gives you don't it's crazy that this is a John Wick movie. Every movie with Keanu Reeves is not a John Wick movie. But he's got a beard. When she's ten Oracle, I believe. Ew. Time to fly. If you want the truth, Neo, you're going to have to fly me. This song is very on the nose with some things here. Granted, the first one is very. Is still here. Alice in Wonderland. You're still fighting, and why you will never give up. You don't know me. No. Oh, damn. How dare you stand where he stood? <laughs> Harry Potter reference. Oh. Ew. I don't know how I feel. I mean, I know Hugo Weaving probably didn't want to be in this script. That was trippy. After all these years, to be going back to where it all started. Back to the Matrix. Lancaster native Jonathan Groff. Mm -hmm. We all like local people around here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, that actually looked uh, pretty good. I don't know where... Obviously, I, like I said, I haven't seen the second or the uh, third, so I don't know exactly know where things went or are going. Or what could they what could they even do with a fourth? Was it left on like a cliffhanger? No. <laughs> <laughs> so... Mm -hmm. It kind of makes sense, because the first three very loosely, obviously, follow the story of the Bible and Jesus Christ and everything. Mm -hmm. um, 
It's not a religious movie at all, but it's very, like, there's a Judas character played by Joe Pantaleano, Pantaleano friend of the podcast. Uh, of course. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he, uh, Neo, if you haven't seen two or three, stop watching now, Neo sacrificed himself at the end. to the And it was so on the nose because he had his arms out like he was on the cross. Mm hmm so it's very, very obviously a reference to Jesus Christ. This one being called Resurrection, I'm assuming he's resurrected because he's dead at the end of three, but they make it seem like it's not going to continue probably because they didn't want to continue it at that time. Um, Here we are like 15 yeah, years later. Pretty much everything else about the film, the, the two, other two, you don't need to know. I'm pretty sure they destroyed the computer. So the fact that there's an, another Matrix... I don't know. I could be wrong about that. I haven't seen two or three since they were in theaters mm -hmm. because I didn't like them that much. Um, so, you know, this one could be completely ignoring two and three. I don't think it is. But, yeah, we'll have to see. We'll definitely have to see. I'll definitely have to watch the trilogy. Uh, we could have a little, I got a little sleepover bit at my house. Catching up to do, I guess, yeah. as you can see. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it looked interesting. I really wish, I don't know if they were making it happen, but I really wish they uh, did a back-to-back -back Keanu weekend like they were planning to before COVID had to Yeah, push yeah, that's, uh, I mean, I, I, you can't really blame them on that. No, that's no, no. COVID completely. Uh, but yeah, Lana Wachowski is doing this without her sister. For I think this is the first movie she's ever done by herself without Lily. I could be wrong about that, but I, you know. Usually they're a yeah. duo. And... You know, that's not to say that there's any rift between them. I doubt there is a rift between them because I think they're still working together on other stuff. Mm -hmm. But interesting to see how uh, uh, Lana does by herself. Um, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? But we shall see it when it comes out. Um, we shall. I didn't see the date. I think it's uh, December 22nd. If Ooh. It, yeah. We so. could be having a little Christmas treat. Yes, Christmas treat. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, yeah, it looks really interesting. I'm, I'm excited for it. So, we'll see. So we shall see. We shall see. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, you know, there's a bunch of stuff you can click on here in a second. But we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye, -bye. Turn on the fucking air!